More reforms are coming to the NYPD. The city council passed several bills designed after widespread protests over police brutality. But opponents argue the legislation will only make the city less safe. CBS 2's Andrew Grimes explains. This package of police legislation will either help improve the NYPD or help hamper it, depending on who you ask. It includes five bills the city council just approved. I think we made a meaningful step forward um, in, in providing um, some real accountability to the police department on behalf of New Yorkers. Brooklyn Councilman Stephen Levin proposed one of the bills which will greatly limit qualified immunity for cops, making it much easier to sue a police officer if your rights are violated. Mayor de Blasio says he supports it because the city will be financially liable, not the officer. Some question if that goes far enough. What I want is individual level responsibility that will change the calculus of an officer on the street. For potentially tens of thousands of dollars that that was going to tell a whole lot of people this was not a job they could pursue. Some of the other bills would require the NYPD to issue a quarterly report on all traffic stops and would shift crash investigations that involve serious injury to the Department of Transportation instead. Opponents of the package include the police unions. They set up this electronic billboard outside City Hall Thursday arguing the priority instead should be reducing an alarming spike in gun violence, especially in minority neighborhoods. Every uh, bill that they put in is making it more difficult for our detectives and the police in the street to do their job. These laws, these bills are going to cause police to be less proactive and the people that are going to suffer are the black and brown people of the inner city. Councilman Levin says these reforms are just a start, promising more in the future. The mayor does plan to sign this package into law. Outside City Hall, Andrea Grimes, CBS 2 News. On qualified immunity, the NYPD says, as written, the law will simply encourage more lawsuits and make it easier for plaintiffs to name individual officers.